mess for frustrated commuters on the Hutchinson River Parkway tonight. It took seven hours to clean it up after a truck hit an overpass and burst into flames. In a CBS2 exclusive, our Tony Aiello caught up with the driver and tried to find out why he was on the parkway in the first place. Walk me through what happened. How come you didn't see it coming? The trucker who caused the trouble is Ishad Knight. Any comment? I don't know, man. It's just uh, on his mistake, man. He didn't say much to me, but earlier, this man who disrupted countless commutes was on the phone doing some serious explaining. Stupidity. <laughs> Stupidity? Yeah. Driver Don Gamble among those stuck in miles of traffic after a tall tractor trailer hit the low King Street overpass on the Hutch right on the New York Connecticut state line. The big rig burst into flame, fueled in part by its cargo, liquid margarine. I'm getting sick and tired of these drivers, uh, especially these truck drivers, not knowing where they're going. Indeed, Westchester County Police say the trucker wasn't using a commercial GPS that would have steered him off the parkway where trucks are banned. Instead, Knight told police he was navigating using Google Maps on his smartphone. I guess his phone isn't so smart. <laughs> People who live nearby have grown accustomed to the disruption. My house shakes every time truck hits the bridge. The county says bridge strikes have actually dropped 50% in two years. These low bridge alerts painted on many approaching roadways have helped warn truckers, but not today. So you got to pay attention, don't you? No, it's, it's not that, boss. Well, what is it if you're not paying attention? Ashad Knight will face a myriad of motor vehicle citations. In Rybrook, Westchester County, Tony Aiello, CBS2 News.